In this tutorial, we will teach you how to export a video or a still frame in Adobe Premiere Pro CS6. Once you have your project completed, go to the File menu, move over to Export and select the Media option. The Export Settings window would open up. Move over to the Export Settings window and expand the Format menu where you will be provided with a long list of different formats for the output. For instance, if you want this project to provide you with a format which should be compatible with portable media players like PSP and smartphones, you can select the MPEG-4 option. Once done, choose a preset option according to the device you're making the clip for. If you want to produce the video in high resolution, choose the .avi format. This format allows you to have the best video results with no compression whatsoever. Move over to the preset option next and select the one which best fits your requirements. For example, in this case, we will be selecting the PAL DV widescreen option. Next, go to the output name section and click on the file name appearing right next to the option. Once the new window pops up, you can rename the file. You can even change the location where the file would be saved by simply browsing to another location. Once done, simply click on the save button to save the file in that location. Now click on the Export button below to start saving the whole project. When talking about exporting still frames, things are a little different. Move the seek bar to the position of the frame which you want to export. For example, we will grab the still image of the underwater scene in this video. Once done, go to the Program Monitor and click on the Export Frame button, denoted by the camera icon, in order to export the frame. Alternatively, you can press the Control shift e key on the keyboard for this. Once done, the export frame window would open where you can change the name, format, and location of the file being saved. Expand the format menu and you can select from the many options available. We will select the JPEG format for this frame. Now move to the path option and click on the browse button to select the location where you want to save that JPEG file. Once done, click on OK and you're done. Now go to the respective path and you will find the exported frame there.